Well, we're out for the evening and uh, it looks like it might rain, but we'll see. The puppies went out. They were on their 16 foot leashes and I tell you, I wish they would go in the same direction because it's like this trying to, <laughs> trying to navigate it without it getting all tangled up. But I managed this time. Now coming here, I did pass a place and I have a great barbecue pork sandwich. Oh my God, it's so good. So I'm glad that I stopped there. And I've got puppies nonnering again. They slept the whole way here. We get here, they get out, they run, they eat, they sleep. <laughs> run, eat, sleep. That's it. Yeah, tough life. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. So, I went today and I stopped at the um, secondhand store because I wanted to get a little cover up when I don't want to wear a heavy coat and stuff out there and it starts to get chilly, I found a little cover up and then I forgot, oh yeah, Halloween's coming up. So they had cowboy hats out there. Now the best cowboy hat that they had out there, they had the cheapest price on, so they don't know hats. It's a 7X, 7X beaver hat. So that's, I mean, you know, that's already better. And uh, another thing I got, look at this. I got a great deer skin pouch that was $5 for deer skin. Can't beat that, so I grabbed that up real quick. I'm gonna use it for some of my um, tarot cards. And then I got this belt. And look at that, that would make a nice hat band could use that to make a hat band. Yeah. So I found that. And uh, I'll show you the hat I got. Here it is. Here it is. Look at that. Now it's got a couple little holes, a whole little hole here, a little hole there. Doesn't matter. I can work on it, but it's a uh, Phillips boot shop from Carlsbad, New Mexico. And it's a seven and one eighth hat. And it is a, um, what does it say? I can't read it. Bradford. LTD, trying to read it. Well, I'll have to get where I have better light so I can read the whole thing, but it's a seven and an eighth extra long oval. So if somebody had an extra long oval head, this would fit. That's what I mean, you know, this is a silver belly colored hat, silver belly, okay. Now on me, it's huge, 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 huge. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yeah. <Yeehaw! laughs> but I thought I would use this one and uh, I might um, do some, some burned, burning a design in it and then maybe painting it with the, uh, those inks. So that's what I'm thinking about that I might do with it. And I did find a, um, hold on, did find, let me see if I can see the other thing I got here. Here it is. I got this little bag if I want to just take a small deck with me to row cards. Can put it in there, easy to carry. And I found this piece, which makes a nice color hat band on this hat, actually. I'll show you this. there. So 
So you can see just how much a little thing like that would do. Oh, I got it upside down. The flowers need to go the other way. Okay, let's do this again. So there we go. But you can see that's in great color with that hat band. Okay. So I could do these flowers and then maybe try to do a duplicate of those flowers, burn it in and paint them. So I might try to do that because this hat was four bucks. Okay, <laughs> four bucks for a 7X beaver hat. You can't beat that. The rest of them were, you know, cheap little things and they had them marked $10 twelve dollars eight dollars okay then I found this pin which is I like that little hat pin okay and I got another hat pin I got a one that I'm gonna put on my other hat my black hat it's a prisoner of war print pin um, POW pin which I'm going to uh, use and and uh, on my one hat. So yeah, I was happy to find these. And I'm looking forward to being able to uh, to do that burning on this. I think I need to get a little chalk chalk marker so I can draw draw it on here first so that I can see to uh, to burn the image on there because chalk you can wipe off right away easily so I think I will do that as well oh my goodness so I was uh, watching videos a little bit to see, you know, if there's something else to read on. And uh, so we'll have to see. I don't know what that call is. Uh, so on that note, I'll leave that here. Just wanted to let people know we're all good. We're out here. We, M Mr. Mickey, yes, Mr. Mickey is leaning his head over there. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really close-up view of doggy fur. <laughs> oh, mercy. Oh, mercy. I think that's a pretty, pretty scenery. Oh, as you see, I changed this one. Uh, I, got, I got rid of the one, the hanging things, because they're so lightweight, they would break all the time. So this one won't break, and if it hits the window, it's easy because it's macrame behind there. So I did change that one out. So, yeah, all good. And then I changed on the other side as well. I'll show you what we have up here. Let's see it up here. This one. So I got those at the farmer's market this week when I went. I thought those were great. So that's what's going on today. We're just going to hang out here for today and tonight. And uh, then head back tomorrow because I've got Hoga, Hoga Lee time. And uh, so probably easier to do it back at the house than it is out here. Although where I'm at is quite fine. It's quiet out here. There's nobody around, so I'm not having barky dogs. So we'll see how it goes. How the weather is, everything. This is a nice big size bag. Wow, Mickey, you <laughs> go. Oh, that's a little too much, Mickey. So on that note, I'll leave that here, and I'm make make make. He keeps leaning his head on here, and all we get are his chin whiskers, <laughs> fur. <laughs> I'm 
You silly boy, Mr. Mickey. Ah, uh, so thanks for tuning in. And uh, if there's something else to read on, let me know. And I'll see you online.